I'd like to speak with a manager. I'm the manager. How can I help you? Look at my hair. It's lovely. I'm not going to beat around the bush. I am very upset with this haircut. It's by far the worst haircut I've ever gotten. The hairstylist didn't listen to me at all. This is not the style I asked for. I'm fit to be tied. I'm sorry you didn't get what you were expecting, but I have to tell you, I saw you when you walked in. I did a double take when I saw you after the haircut. I think this style really suits you. It's a dramatic improvement. But it's too short, and it has all these layers. I look ridiculous. Not at all. You just aren't used to it. Trust me, it brings out your eyes, and it makes you look more sophisticated. You're just trying to make me feel better. No, I'm being entirely honest. You look elegant and sophisticated. I have a wedding to go to this weekend, and I want it to look my best. Perfect. You're going to blow them away with your new style. You really think so? Absolutely. I'll tell you what. See what happens at the wedding. If your family and friends don't like it, come back next week and we'll give you any haircut you want on the house. Well, okay. I guess that's fair. New fad diets that promise quick results with little effort appear all the time. Some of these diets that have appeared through the years have been truly strange and silly. One recent fad diet that was popular with famous people was the baby food diet. This diet suggests that a few tiny jars of baby food should replace one or two meals each day. While exchanging adult meals for small jars of food may result in weight loss, this diet has clear drawbacks. Aside from the fact that baby food has a texture and taste that is unappealing to adults, the small portions aren't enough to keep an adult healthy. Replacing meals with baby food results in a significant drop in calories that can leave the dieter feeling weak and dizzy. Perhaps one of the strangest recent fad diets is the cotton ball diet. As its name suggests, people on this diet eat cotton balls. The idea is that the cotton balls are low in calories and very filling, so the dieter would not have an appetite for other fattening foods. Obviously, this is a completely ridiculous diet. Aside from the fact that cotton balls have no taste and a terrible texture, this diet can be dangerous. It doesn't provide any of the vitamins and nutrients a person needs to survive. In addition, it can lead to digestive problems. One fad diet that has come in and out of fashion since the 1970s is the cabbage soup diet. While this diet isn't guaranteed to result in weight loss, it is guaranteed to make the dieter miserable. On this restrictive diet, the only food that you can eat any time is cabbage soup, a food that is filling and low in calories. In addition to this bland soup, you can only eat certain food groups on certain days. For example, aside from the soup, on the first day, you can only eat fruit. On the second day, you can only eat vegetables. Because this diet is so restrictive, it is difficult to stick with it. It's not surprising that common side effects include mood swings and low energy levels. There seems to be no limit to what people have been willing to try in order to lose weight.
One. One recent fad diet that was popular with some famous people was the baby food diet. Two. Baby food has a texture and taste that is unappealing to adults. Three. The small portions aren't enough to keep an adult healthy. Four, it doesn't provide any of the vitamins and nutrients a person needs to survive. Five, this diet isn't guaranteed to result in weight loss.